check tonight. Okay, try to think back. What were you doing when you were six years old? Well, we have an answer for what Lilo was doing. She was teaching herself to play the piano. Okay, so welcome to the show. Clearly Thanks. you have made a lot of progress since then. You play the piano, you sing, you've got a full band, and you're getting ready to release an EP. That's exciting. Yeah. Thank you for coming on the show. How would you describe your music to people that haven't heard you yet? This EP is definitely R&B soul. Ooh, okay. And what's your inspiration? Where do you find the inspiration for all your music? Everywhere, um, but I grew up listening to a lot of Motown, Ooh. Stax Records, soul music my mother's music, <laughs> so that really inspired this record a lot. I so how say. did you actually, you were six years old and you taught yourself how to play piano? How do you do uh, that? There was just a piano <laughs> in the house and I would just go over and try and learn songs myself. I don't know how great it sounded, but <laughs> I just had one there, so I was always interested in figuring it out. That's so cool, and now clearly you figured a lot out because your last single, Don't Stop the Music, reached number 34 on the Billboard charts. Congratulations. Thank you. That's amazing. It was also the top 10 song of the year on the UK club charts. How does this all feel? Feels really good. <laughs> <laughs> and then now this Saturday night, you're having your release show. Mm -hmm. So what can people look forward to there? Um, well, I'm going to be playing with my seven-piece band. Yes. And we're going to play songs from the record and some songs from my past record and some goodies that y'all might be able to sing along with. Ooh. And Matthew here is opening. He's going to do a wonderful set to start off the night. So awesome. it's going to be a good party. It's going to be a good time. And then your EP doesn't actually come out for a couple of weeks, but people might be able to get like a secret copy. On Saturday? So there will be pre-release copies what? on Saturday available. And then the first single comes out in two weeks. Cool. Exciting. Okay, well, we are going to be right back in just a couple minutes and actually hear from Lilla and the band. Thank you. We'll be right back. Finally tonight, we will leave you with music from Lilla. Her EP release show is this Saturday night at the Jack London Review, and you can find all of her music at lillamusic.com. So have a good night. Take it away, Lilla.
Oh, well, thank you so much, Lilla. Of course, okay, so when can people actually look forward? When is your EP officially coming out? <laughs> Or when's the single coming out? The first single. The off first of the EP. single comes out. Let's see what's the date. Two weeks from Monday. Two oh, from Monday. Uh, not this Monday, but the following one. What's that date? So I'm gonna have a calendar. Twenty second. Twenty second. Yeah, that sounds right. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So twenty second. And what is the title of the first single? Did we get to know? Get to my love. Get to my love. And of course, this song was way down south. And you said there's not many people that have gotten to hear it yet because it is off of your new EP. Right, you guys got an exclusive listen right exclusive now. Exclusive listen. Do you want to, before we run out of time, do you want to introduce your band to us? Sure. Right over here we got Matthew Flowers, Samuel Eisenmeyers, <laughs> Sam Arnold. <laughs> Sam Arnold, yes, amazing. Okay, well, again, you can check out our music at lillamusic.com. So have a great night, everybody. Thank you for watching. With extra time at the end, like...